Welcome back to Vegas. It's Dave Las Vegas, and you're watching Vegas Elite TV. In this video, I'll show you all my seven best ultra cheap beats drinks here in Las Vegas. Today, I'm at the downtown Fremont Street. We'll also check out the best barbecue, and it was delicious. I'll also show you guys an LA style street hot dog spot, and they have the best Mexican corn, hands down. We'll also check out Cadillac Mexican Kitchen's outstanding happy hour with my pops and a place that offers a three course prime rib dinner with salad and dessert for only $13.99. Plus the best pizza at the Fremont Street. And it was hot like fire, mmm, delicious. Plus the cheapest margaritas in town, it's only $1.99 and a place that offers steak and lobster for only $11.99 from 9 p.m. to 11 p.m. every single day. Plus, we'll check out a club at the downtown Fremont Street with the most amazing views. And last but not least, you know your boys gotta check out the Mob Museum Secret Speakeasy Lounge. I uttered the secret word and I was in. Let's get started. Number seven, I'm at the all new Circa Hotel and Casino at a place called Project Barbecue. They're open pretty late and their smoked barbecue ribs was only $17 and the meat was so tender. Best ribs at the Fremont Street. Number six, now I'm gonna take you guys to a place called Pizza Rock. And they have the best pizza slices. They have the best pizza at the Fremont Street here in Las Vegas, hands down. These guys have incredible reviews. The pizza's fresh and simply delicious. Need I say more? Number five. Now I'm gonna take you all to the Golden Nuggets Cadillac Mexican Kitchen. Here's the video. Now I'm off to the Golden Nugget Casino to meet up with my pops for happy hour at this really cool Mexican cantina restaurant. It's the Cadillac Mexican Kitchen and they have an awesome happy hour. And the restaurant looks incredible with tequila bottles stacked everywhere. So from four to six, they have salsa. I got the chicken wings, the cantina chicken wings for eight bucks. My pops got their tacos. It's three tacos, eight bucks. He got the fish tacos, $5 beers, $5 margaritas. And they have $5 well spirit drinks where you can get scotch, bourbon, stuff like that. So it's a pretty good place. So if you guys like margaritas, they have the best margaritas at the Fremont Street. My pops is simple. He's got his beer. I got my scotch. All I need now is a cigar and life is good. The chicken wings, the cantina chicken wings was awesome. The tacos were amazing. Everything at this place is awesome. All right, so my pops went back to the airport to catch the red eye out of Vegas. Number four. Now I'm on my way to the California Casino's Market Street Cafe. And this cafe has a lot of really great specials to offer. It's definitely a Hawaiian theme casino. So the Market Street Cafe has a lot of Hawaiian theme entrees as well, including oxtail soup and it's really good so i'm working with their three course dinner special after four it includes that salad which was pretty good uh it's a prime rib dinner so you get your salad uh vegetables baked potato and this isn't bad for 13 dollars 99 plus you get your dessert so you get your salad, your steak, your baked potato, your vegetables, and their prime rib steak was actually not bad. And not to mention, this includes the baked potato. You get your baked potato, you know, your sour cream. You can butter it up with some butter. You can't go wrong. Plus vegetables. And it's not that bad. It's pretty good. 
plus the dessert was really good. So winner, winner, prime rib dinner. And you know what, guys? This is what I love about the downtown Fremont Street. You can walk to strip, drink a cocktail, watch some live music, and find some really good deals at the Fremont Street. So I took a pic with some showgirls. There's actually a lot of really cool bars at the Fremont Street. You can actually do a bar hop and just go from bar to bar. But anyway, I'm here to check out this $11.99 steak and lobster special. It's at the Fremont Casino at a place called Tony Roma's. So from 9 p.m. to 11 p.m. every single day, you get a sirloin steak, lobster tail, vegetables, and a baked potato for $11.99 deal. Plus, at the bar, they offer a $1.99 margaritas. So, winner, winner, chicken dinner. You know, you get your drink, you walk the strip, and just enjoy. So, you walk the strip, and you run into some showgirls. And they'll take a pic with you, but they want a tip. So, you know, hey, nothing in life is free. But you know what? You got a great pick. Let's move on. Number three. Here's the video. I've been to their original location over on Rainbow. This location's fairly new. It just opened up, so I'm excited to check out the Snoop Dogg hot dog. And it comes with their famous gin and juice ketchup, barbecue sauce, billionaire bacon, and grandma slaw. Now, they're also known for their Mexican corn. They have some outstanding Mexican corn. So I tried their Hot Cheetos corn last time I was here, and it's amazing. But this time I wanted to check out their dirty corn, because it reminds me of a traditional Mexican corn. So their carne asada steak fries is bomb. I had that before. But you can see their prices aren't that bad. And they even have a vegan hot dog. And you can see they have an amazing selection of their hot dogs. They have their famous dirt dog hot dog, which I had last time. Let's do the Mexicans and dirty corn. So would you like the corn on the top or corn on the cup? No, corn on the cup is cool. Yeah. And, uh, and, uh, those garlic fries. Yeah, those garlic fries. So now we wait. So the place is actually located right near the Heart Attack Burger Restaurant. But one thing that I love about this place is their art decor. Although the location on Rainbow actually has more art decor, you could see Kobe, rest in peace, DMX, rest in peace, and of course the legend Snoop Dogg and Dr. Dre. Orders up. So there it is. Gin and juice ketchup, check. Barbecue sauce, check. Billionaire bacon, check. Grandma slaw, check. And it's on a lobster roll. So yeah, it looks delicious. So instead of using a traditional hot dog bun, they use a lobster roll. So last time I was here, I tried their flaming Hot Cheetos corn. But this time I wanted to get their dirty corn. And everything looks good. So last time I was here, I had their dirty fries with their spicy ketchup. This time I got their garlic fries. But anyway, it's time to eat. And this right here is a true LA style hot dog. It's loaded. delicious and i'm not a big fan of eating a hot dog but i will say this i'm full and i still gotta eat the dirty corn and i still gotta eat the fries <laughs> fireworks this is like eating a corn on steroids now i've had their flaming hot cheetos before so i already know i was expecting some amazing corn and the garlic fries was good so now it's time to finish the corn So the manager came to the table and caught me this delicious dessert. It's their horse shot of ice cream with a churro on top. And it looks delicious. I'm already full, but I'm gonna try this for you guys. And all I gotta say is, whoa, I could not stop eating this. And not to mention, I was already full. Incredible. So one out of 10, I give this place a 10. Outstanding. Best L.A. style street hot dogs in Las Vegas, hands down. Actually, it's the only L.A. style street hot dogs in Vegas. 
And what's cool, it's at the Fremont Strip. So I had a great time with you all. And may we usher in 2022. May we have a great and prosperous new year. And I'll be back to celebrate the new year with my next video at Gordon Ramsay's Hell's Kitchen. Now let's get to my number one spot at Fremont Street. Number one. On the Las Vegas Strip to check out the Mob Museum's famous Speakeasy Lounge. So of course, Las Vegas has mob connections. Going back to the mayor, Oscar Goodman, he was a mob attorney before he even became the mayor of Las Vegas. So to get to the Mob Museum's uh, Speakeasy Lounge, you got to go to the back. And I believe the password was Juice Bar. The guy asked me who sent, who sent me. I, I told him the security guard. I don't know. But I'm in. But hey, this place is pretty cool. And because it's connected to the Mob Museum, they actually have uh, authentic artifacts and things like this right here. So it's actually a prop from the Untouchables movie with Sean Connery. It's the actual gun that he used. Man, this I love this place. I'm excited to be here. I got the old-fashioned. It's happy hour, so I got 20% off. I was looking at this cup trying to figure out what to do. The guy next to me said, open the book. So there it is. There's my drink. You pour your drink in the glass. Cheers, guys. I've always wanted to check out an authentic speakeasy concept and the Mob Museum Speakeasy Lounge definitely hits the spot. So I saved the best for last, guys. The last place that I wanted to check out with y'all is back at the Circa Casino. This is where I was staying at during this week. At the 60th floor, there's this lounge. It's called the Legacy Club. It's one of my favorite places to check out at the Fremont Street now. It's upscale. $1.7 million gold bars. Whoa. That's pretty cool. But this view at this lounge, it's a million dollar view of the Las Vegas Strip. They have great drinks, great drink specials, depending on what time you go there. But it's free to get in here. You just got to order a drink unless there's a big event or something happening. But this is a staple of Las Vegas to check out the Fremont Street. I got me a beer. I went outside to check this view and I said this is a million dollar view. But you know what, guys? This is not a million dollar view. It's a billion dollar view. Cheers. All right, guys and gals, that about wraps it up. If you're new to my channel, make sure you all subscribe to my channel. But most importantly, hit the notification bell for new video notifications so you're updated immediately when new videos are posted on my channel. You guys have a great day. Thanks.